hello everyone today i am going to create these two type of roof designs in revit and also i am going to attach a model in place soffit along them but before we start let me ask you to like and share my videos leave a comment below and subscribe to my channel and also if you have any kind of difficulty or query related to revit you can ask me anytime so now let's start open a new architectural template file in revit then go to the level 2 floor plan and select this roof command in the architecture tab select this circle and check this define slope and then draw a rectangle like this let's create an of uh, this type of design you can create any type of cut within this roof and add this split line as shown then go to the 3d and select this click on modify sub elements and select it and add an ele uh, this elevation point for these for these uh, split line points and let's add minus eight feet for these two points so that it goes below then go to the west elevation and select it select the roof click on modify sub elements and select and drag this till you meet this upper green line so that it, uh, all of the points are on us on the same slope so now you can see how easy it is to create this type of roof in revit then now let's create another one i'm going to create this roof in the top a view of the 3d again draw a rectangle using the roof command click ok then let's uh, create the top view uh, top plan of the plan view of the roof using the model line uh, i am placing this line so that it is easy for me to place the split lines As for now, I have defined the lines. Uh, let's add some split lines as you can see in the video. now go to the 3d select the roof click on modify sub elements select select this point and add the elevation point of 10 feet ignore the error and then select this one add 10 feet height and then select this middle one again add the 10 feet now select I'm going to select this one and add an elevation of 12 feet and then I'm going to add the elevation of 12 feet here delete these lines as we don't need them anymore so now you can see the roof designs are complete now let's place a soffit along this roof let's uh, move it a little bit okay now uh, you can see the designs and now to place the soffit along this roof uh, go to the component model in place and select roof from this dialog box click ok select the sweep command uh, sketch path and set the reference plane to this surface and then uh, define the path like this then click ok and go to the south elevation to draw the profile and i'm going to create a 
rectangle like this and all of these dimensions are hypothetical uh, all the dimensions are based upon your design okay now in the level 2 or level 1 floor plan add a reference plane here and assign a name to it I'm going to name it 1 then go to the south elevation and select extrusion set the reference plane to 1 and draw a triangle like this select click ok then drag it Go drag it such that it should meet the sweep like this then join the sweep with the extrusion using the join command Now repeat this exact same process uh, step to place the soffit on the other side as well. If the uh, both sides are similar, you can use the mirror command as well or copy command. Okay, click on finish model and now you can see how the soffit is attached with the roof. And if you don't want to these lines to be shown, then using the join commands, join the roof with this soffit. And that's all for today. I hope you like this tutorial. If you have any kind of difficulty or query related to Revit, you can ask me anytime. I will meet you guys in the next video. Till then, goodbye and take care. And most importantly, don't forget to like, share and subscribe.